Well, I'm going to go back to Fulton Dale first. Uh, we knew Fulton Dale was outstanding team. We knew they had some college prospects, D1 prospects. And going into their house and playing. And I think coming out of that, you know, we, we was worried about, of course, we had Savannah. And Savannah was a bad team, uh, but they didn't have the speed that Fulton Dale had. And we was more worried about, you know, what kind of high we'd be on and, you know, if we played well. And we did play well against Savannah. But then moving into Pima, knowing our kids, and our, our kids believed they could beat them. We, we knew we could beat them. Uh, but it's a little bit different going to the field of champions and playing. But uh, our kids, you know, never had doubt. I, th I think we had a little doubt in the first half when once they got up on us and they scored the first play of the game. I think our kids had a little doubt. But second half, I mean, I, I think that just that one quick touchdown energized us. And, you know, it, it's great for our program, you know. He won't have been beaten in two years except by Georgia team, right, Mark? So, yeah, that says a lot for our program, too. And, you know, to, you were raced to a 21 nothing deficit. Then you end up having to rally again. You scored two touchdowns in the last minute and a half. Yeah, I, um, I mean, just it, describe what that was like for you and your players. Well, you know, we, we scored our first quick, it was 21-7, uh, and then we wound up getting the ball back. We was going back to the first half, we probably should have scored two times before then, which we didn't score before half time. We had the ball inside of 10. But, you know, we, we raced it down to 21-21, and then they just bounced back and scored again. And then we we wound up scoring out there close to the end and elected to go to two for two, like we did a year ago against Welburn which it didn't pan out for us. And then by the grace, we got the onside kick. You know, the ball just happened to take a, a great bounce straight up and they didn't go for it and we went for it. So, you know, it was a great um, experience, but uh, you know, scoring that, that quick, you know, they shut us out first half and we scored two that quick. You know, it's just, it's a lot of luck with it too. You've been to this point in the season, but I think that that 2003 team, um, I mean, most of these guys, some of them weren't even, you know, they weren't even in school yet. So, is there any advantage for you guys, um, experience-wise? I don't think. I mean, you know, I don't think there's any advantage. I mean, I think it's it was Chris's first time, I think, and I think uh, it'll be these these kids right here's first time. But you know, going back to that, my my son, which is a senior this year, he plays. He's just, we we look back at a picture in 2003. He was riding a bus. He was about four years old. I'm um, say he was uh, four years old. Had his Randolph County helmet getting on that charter bus, going to Pisgah and going to Red Bay. And so we, we we brought out that picture my wife did the other day, and it's just amazing, you know, seeing him at that age and those kids. Well, I didn't see the other kids, but I saw him. And now he's playing for Randolph County as senior in the state championship game. 